everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Michaela. I am from Soul Stunning Family. In today's video, I'm going to be discussing my family Christmas traditions. I have a list. I wrote them down. So, I also want to mention before I get started on my list, I'm doing a giveaway, a $25 Target gift card giveaway. If you guys are interested, my Vlogmas Day 7 video with the rules to enter this giveaway will be in the description below. So the first thing that I wrote down is we go to La Salette. So basically it is an outdoor thing. I believe it's at a church. Um, it's free. It's always packed, but it's free. And you walk around the whole entire place and it is lit up beautifully. It's gorgeous. There's hot chocolate and other things you can purchase. Um, it's something I've done every year, even when I was little, and now I bring my kids. My list is going to pick out a tree. And part of that is also decorating the tree. So we go, we don't always go to the same place, but it's usually already cut, so we've never been to like a farm. I want to do that, so I would like to start to make that a tradition. Um, that would be fun. But yeah, we get a fake tree. I mean, a real tree. And we decorate it as a family, so it's always fun with the lights on, decorations, we listen to music when we do it. It's always a good time. In the past couple years, we've also helped decorate my friend's tree. Although, last night we did this, and I didn't help, but my children did. <laughs> Mostly Cam. Um, the next thing is number three. It is a chocolate calendar, like the advent calendars that they have. We do one of those. We just started Mavis's on those this year. <laughs> um, she's thrilled <laughs> every morning when she gets one. Or well, we try not to do it in the morning, but every day when she gets one. Every year we write a letter to Santa Claus. If you guys have any traditions that you do in your family year after year for the holiday season, let me know in the description below what they are. I would love to hear them. But we also go to a parade every year, and usually when we go to the parade, we give the letters to Santa. There. Some of the elves collect them and we give them to Santa. So we're supposed to be going to one tomorrow and that's what we'll be doing. Every year I let my kids pick out one new ornament for the tree. Um, something that they're into that year or whatever they really feel like getting, but just one every year for each of them. I guess Mavis was kind of new. She didn't do it last year. She was just a baby. I picked one out for her. I got the baby's first Christmas. But this year, she picked out Cookie Monster. <laughs> and Kia was at school, so I'm going to bring him to do that eventually. <laughs> First, we didn't go there to get it, but she saw it and she wanted it, so I was like, I guess I can let you get it now. Um, every year I donate my children's toys and clothes. I try to donate some of my own clothes as well to families in need because, you know, my kids are going to be getting more clothes and more toys for Christmas and I'd like to get rid of them. And I would like to help out others who might need them. So that is something we do. Typically, I do that with them, well, with Cam, so he can know what giving is about. I don't exactly... We should do more. Maybe we will. Um, I like to make Christmas cards with them. Um, 
I also like to make family Christmas cards of them <laughs> to send to others, but they like to make their own Christmas cards to give to their close family members. Usually do one for my mom and my dad, my friend Michelle, their aunt, us. <laughs> they have a good time. They have a good time making them. It's awesome. Not necessarily a Christmas card, but like a Christmas ornament or something Christmas related, like the Christmas gift. Um, sorry I say um a lot. I noticed that I do. I apologize for that. And here are some traditions that we typically do the night before Christmas. So on Christmas Eve, I let my children open one gift and it is typically pajamas and a movie maybe some slippers so they can watch a movie in their pajamas. The next thing that I do before they go to bed, I mean, this isn't in any order or anything like that, but the next thing that we do, one of the things that we do, I mean, is read Twas the Night Before Christmas, and we read some other Christmas books as well, but definitely Twas the Night Before Christmas. I also make cookies for Santa with them. We bake cookies every year. It's a lot of fun. We typically do it from scratch. Once I got a Tolos box, but I like to make them from scratch. I like to use my cookie cutters because I have a bunch of cookie cutters and I think the kids enjoy it more. We watched that movie that they got for Christmas. It's typically a Christmas movie, but not always. Sometimes if they really want a movie, it'll be in there as well. And we also make the reindeer food. So it's just super easy. It is, you literally put in glitter and oatmeal. And you sprinkle it on your lawn so the reindeer have something to eat, as well as carrots. And you can leave out carrots for them too, but we just flew. You just sprinkle it on your front lawn and they know where to go. They know that you're waiting for them. Those are my family traditions that I've done over the years with my children. Some of them have been passed along from my mom or from other family members. Some of them I started on my own because I thought they were cool. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, don't forget to check out my giveaway. Um, it'll be in my Vlogmas Day 7 video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Hope you guys gave it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. And that you guys hit that bell. <laughs> but either way, Merry Christmas, Merry Vlogmas, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Thank you.